me and my husband just finished our little session. By the way, happy Saturday. We are on our way, Millie and I. Oh, look at my hair. <laughs> Millie and I are on our way to watch Angry Birds Part 2. Or yeah. Angry Birds 2. <clears throat> so it is a screening. We are excited to see it first before it actually opens up to everybody else in theaters. <laughs> up before this vlog I will leave the link down below or I'll like link it somewhere here but did you yes or no I like it, it was good. oh shoot happy Sunday look what came in so we got some lenses from Amazon we got this Joby grip tight from Amazon and then we got this for Millie's filming from Amazon and then I believe then this is Millie's. So we found this back part. This piece right here was in the box, like way at the bottom. But this is pretty cool, right, Millie? Yeah. You like it? In other news, Papa's gonna dye his hair yeah. of the final. Do you like it, Papa? Drink. Yeah. Uh -oh. So we have a couple of things for camp right here. We got this list that we're going through. Got some insect repellent. Wet ones, hand sanitizer. I love this. Oh, yeah. I could just put a little face cream in here instead of taking the whole thing. There's also these little containers, which I love. We have some AA batteries, Millie's deodorant, some toothpaste. Um, so this moisturizer, I'm going to squeeze out into one of these. We have some sunscreen, first aid kit. I want to take some wipes. Here are our hats, the flashlights. Grandma grabs some snacks for Millie's camp. So I'm headed outside. Millie has to film an audition to be sent in by Friday, but she'll be at girls camp, so. <laughs> Good morning, happy Monday, happy, happy Monday. Today is the day I'm headed to girls camp in Silverwood. Is it Silverwood Lake? I'm picking up four girls because we're going up to set up camp and get everything situated and then the rest of the girls are going to come up. Okay, so girls camp is Monday through Saturday. Let me roll up the window so, so you guys can hear me. Um, Monday through Saturday, but the girls are coming up on Tuesday. Millie is part of the girls, so I am taking the laurel. I'm, I'm excited. It's been a while since I've gone to a girls camp. And uh, the last girls, the last girls camp I went to was in a different stake, and we had like we had like the whole setup. We had the cabin, the kitchen, um, the lodging area. You know, like it was all set up. This this time it's gonna be a little rough. Um, yeah, it's gonna be a little rough. This just happened. So all my tires are fine. It's just the other one was bald. So that's why it popped. I thought I ran over something, but no, the tire, this tire is just worn out. At least this tire will get us there. Oh, what an experience, right? So I wanted to show you guys my little setup. This cot from Walmart is everything. If you're gonna go camping, you may want to look into one of these. It doesn't take a lot of space. It's the same width and length as a sleeping bag. It does get very dark here and the only light we had outside was the moon. Okay, good morning guys. I wanted to check in before we start the day. Um, yesterday was a little rough. There's so many bugs here. 
the shower is a pop-up shower I'm gonna show you guys today I have to use the bathroom really bad so I'm gonna go use the restroom Millie is coming today with the rest of the girls um, and last night surprisingly I slept really good I'm gonna show you guys the tent okay so this is here's the setup we have a I think it's like a four four person tent we have a cooler here we have another cooler here today the kitchen tent is coming and then the 10 by 20 that's gonna go over this part to cover our little living living room area and then this is the 10 um, the 10 body tent now it's starting to get hot we have a group here and then a group over there a group further back there this is very handy keeping my water cool I'm gonna show you guys the shower so we have a little little walkway pathway that goes here thank goodness I got this from Walmart so we're just putting water in here just so we don't have to go back and forth and then the girls are putting their towels here I put a trash bag done um, underneath this little pop-up and then just kind of nailed it to the ground but I just got this from Amazon so then we have two buckets in here and then here's our little our little view okay not little at all this is a huge view there go the white there go the YCL girls they're planning um, they're planning the week for the rest of the girls. Here are all the girls. Oh, oh it's warm here. It was cold. Because we had the air conditioning on. Hi, mommy. Hi, mommy. So we just finished ministering to another ward. We took little treats and then we shared a message. These are a lifesaver for me. In here we have this, a lot of stuff. And then we also have this nifty little gasoline stove. The girls were playing Jenga earlier and that is our garbage can. Good morning guys, happy Wednesday. Today I will be going home and then I'll come back probably Friday. Millie's over there with her age group. Millie can't really vlog so I'm trying to vlog as much as I can. headed back home it is Wednesday we got here Monday it was just very challenging to get up here on Monday besides the flat tire we um, we got lost we clicked on the link that was sent in the email basically we got lost it sent us to the other side of the mountain my car is not um, prepared to go up I don't even know how to drive uphill I'm sure I was supposed to switch the gear to some to another by the time we parked at the campsite my car was smoking so there you have it let me tell you 
I am so excited to go home because I really need to take a really, really good shower. I washed my hair and I made sure Millie washed her hair before she came out here because I knew the whole shower situation. I can't wait to go home and wash my hair. I'm glad I came overall. This was quite the experience. This was straight real camping. Because Millie's the total opposite of me, I know she is like having the time of her life. I do worry that Millie isn't gonna wear her hat because if she doesn't, I know guys, some of you guys are probably like, listen, let her live her life. Let her live her best life for three more days. She will be fine, but there are just a lot of things. I wish I brought a paper to write like notes for Millie, like take your hat. Don't forget to moisturize. Put your Curel on. But if she doesn't wear a hat, if she gets too much sun, she breaks out all over the place. I am traveling back to Los Angeles. My ears are popping. And my car, what was I thinking taking my car? Can we talk about that for a second? I should have rented a car because this baby is 11 years old. She is like not trying to travel to the mountains, up the hills, by the lake. So this will be the last time she travels this far. I actually should start looking for a new car. I made it home. I'm here in the drive-thru just picking up some food for me and the boys. My mom is getting ready to leave to her doctor's appointment. I'm so happy to be home. The air smells different or maybe I'm used to being in this air. So. I'm so glad to be smelling this air and not like the mountain dirt dust. The inside, the inside of my nose feels dirty. My eyes feel dirty. My ears feel dirty, but I am exhausted. Come through filter. Okay, I am ending the vlog right now. Um, I so wish I could talk to Millie to say goodnight and I love her and I miss her and see how her day went. But we all know she's at girls camp and we all know she's in good hands. So, um, we're getting ready to go to bed. Blaze is asleep. Drake is awake, getting ready to go to bed. Um, that's pretty much it. Oh, for dinner we had L&L's. It was so delicious because it's been so long since I've had L&L's. So, that's it. I'll check in with you guys tomorrow. Bye!